What's up guys, so we finally got into the Fresh Start servers and showing off one of the hottest items currently to make money in the servers. This is for Reckoning and Prophecy, the North American Fresh Start servers, Cotton. Cotton is amazing. Cotton only costs one silver to make. It is very cheap to buy. You buy the seed from the actual merchant for one, uh, one silver and 50 copper. It only costs one labor to, to harvest when you actually plant it on a protected farm. Or if you plant it out in the wild, it's still only going to cost a total of two labor to grab, gather, and it grows really quickly. The reason cotton is so good is because people sell it <laughs> and buy it really, really expensively. They buy it for three-ish silver, and you're not just seeing that. I mean, 31,000 pieces of copper have sold in the last 24 hours, or give or take, whatever the amount of time left is on the day. And uh, the average sell price has been 3 silver and 18 copper. That's the average price that people are paying. Some people even paid 9 silver for one of these co cotton. That's crazy. Because, not only with the fact that it's easy and cheap to harvest, but when you harvest, you get approximately 10 of these guys every time. That is insane. You could also have the proc to get that rare item. Uh, I don't know what it's called off the top of my head right now, but... Yeah, so you get 10 cotton every time you harvest this thing, which means you're going to get essentially around 30 silver per labor on a new server for every labor point that you're spending gathering cotton right now. Go farm cotton. Cotton is what you need to be doing. Uh, this has dropped sometimes down to that 79 uh, copper price, but even at that price, it is still pretty damn good silver per labor ratio. For those that don't know too, Dark Age is all about silver per labor. Archage is about using your labor efficiently to make the best silver per labor ratios that you can get. It's not always wise to craft everything yourself. Sometimes it's a lot better to just buy the things and craft things that give you a way better silver per labor ratio or farm things that give you a way better silver per labor ratio. So always utilize your labor very efficiently and that's going to become more of an important thing going forward in these servers because there's not an endless supply of labor that you can generate through workers compensation potions yes you can have an endless amount of alt accounts but getting in with an alt account is very very difficult when you have a huge queue like this so i do have four accounts running right now um, i'm only able to actually log in with one the other ones are still stuck in the queues so having multiple accounts to give you infinite labor is a great idea it's the best thing to do but when they can't log in, they don't really become beneficial in any way or shape or form. So, sadly, that doesn't help you. Anyway, guys, I will talk to you later. Hopefully, you can get in and hopefully you can play. The queue is about three or four hours right now, it looks like. Man, I do hope that they release the third server. I know people are heavily against it because it splits the population slightly, but there's just too many people that want to play, and then you're just start turning away more customers every hour, every minute that goes by that will, won't give Arcage another shot again.